screen now. You ready? Go ahead. Uh, Noah, what does it mean to keep the points record chase alive going into the decision? Yeah, no, I mean, it's a very good result that uh, we want to get the record. So very positive, very happy to get the result and keep building on it. And we've got one more game left and we're going to go out there and win and get the, re uh, get the record. Is the record something that you guys have had in mind or is it all about MLS Cup right now? Yeah, I mean, look, target is MLS Cup, right? That's been the target the whole year. But um, obviously we want to win as much games as possible. And um, now that the opportunity presents itself, um, we really want it and we're really hungry for it. And, you know, again, MLS Cup is in priority, but we're going to go out and go 100% to win the game. What does it say about the squad that Gerardo makes so many changes? Yeah, I mean, everyone has confidence in each other, right? Um, you know, everyone is ready, I feel like. You know, the whole team is ready. And, you know, we were all ready today. And we went out there, and we, we knew we can get the job done, and that's what we did. What was lacking today? We only scored one goal today. Uh, what was lacking maybe to score more goals than one? Yeah, Toronto is a, is a good team. Um, and we went out there. Obviously, we started a bit slow. I felt like we picked up the rhythm during the game. Um, and, and look, you know, there's games that's going to be scrappy like this. And, you know, it's important to get the three points and walk out of it because this is what builds character, I feel like, for our team. And um, especially going into the last game, chasing the record. Yeah, I think the most special thing, in my opinion, and it's very underrated, is the experience, right? I mean, they're such special players and, you know, we watch them and we admire them. But the fact that I can learn from him and defend him in training, um, you know, defend uh, Luis uh, and watch play with Busi and Jordi in the back. Um, for me, it's I can feel like it's helped me grow. And so, in my opinion, ex the experience is honestly the most underrated uh, characteristic that I've taken from them. There's a lot of stories. Uh, I've had a, like a couple with every player, but I'll tell you what, me and, me and Jordi talk a lot, especially because uh, that is my main position, I feel like. Um, and he's been giving me the most tips and we've had the most stories, that's for sure. I, I don't really, there's a lot, there's a lot. <laughs> Yeah, but it's not really a distraction. I think it's it's cool that they're showing love, you know, for not only, you know, uh, Leo and Lucho and, and Busi and Jordi, but, you know, for Inter Miami, you know, they're not only wearing jerseys, they're wearing Inter Miami jerseys, right? So, um, you know, they, they support us, and I think it's pretty dang cool that we get sold out crowds every, every time we travel. So um, I think it's cool, honestly. No, I mean, we were all happy and especially one game closer to the record. Um, and it felt good to get a clean sheet as well. But um, yeah, no, I mean, they're, they're special, right? So, you know, now you, you still don't get starstruck, honestly. You, every game is something different, so. And does having won the, the League's Cup and the Supporters' Shield, you know, make MLS Cup that much more enticing this year? I think we all have the same... We've all had the same goal since the beginning of the year. The beginning of the year was to win the MLS Cup. Um, I don't think anything's changed. I think we're 100% locked in like we were from the first day. Um, but yeah, I mean, we're full of confidence right now, I feel like. So if you want to you know, say that, then yeah. Cool. Any questions over there? Are we good? Good? Okay. Thank you. Thank you.